From the Charles River Basin, this is the Ivy League on ESPN, and we welcome you back to the debut of this Harvard men's heavyweight rowing season for the first time in nearly 34 months. The Harvard heavies are back out on the Charles River, and we are off and running here in our first race of the day. The 4V for Harvard, the 4V for Cornell. It's certainly a big victory here for the Harvard 4V in this race, and the 5V will come in afterward. Harvard's 4V has crossed contest up in Ithaca. And we are off. Harvard is in the boat to your right, the yellow boat, and Cornell is in the boat to your left in red. It's never too difficult to tell where the big red are when you see them out there on the water. And so far, a good start here for Harvard's third varsity as they've already looked to build up a couple of seat lead here. Getting close to the finish line here. Harvard has a sizable advantage here. And it looks like the Crimson will move to 2-0 and oh in their first two races of the day against the Big Red. We'll have the official times for you shortly. The 4v1 at a time of 630.8 wins maybe a little bit stronger here is the Crimson from Massachusetts. And we are off in our final race of the day. It is the 53rd all-time meeting between these two programs the as they get close to the finish. Harvard stroke by Clark Dean, who you mentioned was at the Olympics, helped the Americans to a fifth place finish in the fours. He also boat, uh, rode on that boat with former Harvard rower Andrew Reed, who graduated back in 2014. And right now the Crimson have started that great finish. They put open water between themselves and the Big Red. And we'll wait on the official times, but the Crimson would not let the Big Red get any closer over the closing meters in that race. And Harvard, a perfect start 